Although this was not my most complex mechanical design, there were still a bunch of challenges I had to overcome in order to make this thing. The first challenge was designing this part so it could be printed cleanly in multicolor using my palette. The palette software does allow you to paint solid STL files, but you get a much cleaner slice when the STL file is made up of a bunch of different individual bodies. In this case, we have 120, one for each triangle basically. Once all the parts were printed, the second challenge was the electronics. If I were using a regular DC motor, I could have wired it directly to the switch. The problem with regular DC motors though, they can be super loud. Instead, I used a stepper motor and a silent stepper driver, and this requires a microcontroller and some additional circuitry and soldering. This was the first attempt and I ended up frying the board, so I had to do it twice. But it was worth it in the end because when you turn it on, it runs silently. 